Hi guys, Russell Amadeir. We just are going to do a quick test to see if uh, the post office and post office staff are legally trained regarding um, gyro credit bank slips. So I've got one in my hand here. A lot of people would have seen what these look like. This is from uh, HMRC. So I'm going to see if, if, if they know what this is for. But if you don't know what this is for, obviously you probably don't. If you ask for an invoice or a bill, um, say for your gas, electric or your water, or from HMRC, um, they'll send you a bank gyro credit slip. Not a debit slip, a credit slip. So this actually is a check. If you look across there, this Santander, it'll say Transcash HMRC, um, and you know the bank gyro credit note, which therefore is actually a check. So we're gonna go into the post office now to see if I can cash it in which will be interesting, so let's go. HMRC, you're getting paid twice because what's happening is people send a check in that like check off and send it to pay that bill off. You think it's a bill, but it's actually a credit now. Okay. It's a credit now. <laughs> Everybody's paying twice because it's already been paid for, gas, electric, water. Doing the top says notice to pay. Uh, that does, yeah. But that's a separate issue altogether because you've got to separate that from that. That's should, it should say debit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <coughs> that's it. That's all I want to know. Yeah. Right. Can't do it yet, okay. Though, Thank you very much. Um, <laughs> There you have it. So all you've got to do is ask for an invoice from uh, the energy companies, water, HMRC, and guess what? That's a, that's a check, but they won't accept it as a check. So you need to look into it. Anyway, if you get back in. What you're supposed to do there is write non-transferable across the cheque, non-transferable, get three stamps, stick them on to that, that slip, um, date it, sign it, and that's stamp duty paid. Yeah, on the reverse side of it, it states you're not allowed to write on it. But on the reverse side of it, you need to put for payment of for payment of the site of the sum of whatever the, they say it is, um, transferred by Wesley Hammond, which is me. Then your national insurance number, endorsed by Wesley Hammond. Put the date 2014. This bill of exchange is hereby transferred by endorsement, and that means that obviously it's non-transferable because I can't cash that at a post office or a bank. So therefore it's not transferable. So if you return it to whoever sent it you, which is HMRC, um, they should accept that as paid in full. And that's it. But you just need to look at you just need to look at what it is. Thank you very much. Love and light. A check. Yeah. Even you spotted it as a check. Mm -hmm. But why you filming? Because we just did a little video. You want it? Don't worry. Just on me. So that's a bank gyro credit slip, mm. yeah. Now what you do with that is, you write on there, non-transferable, you put three postage stamps on it, sign and date it, and that means stamp duty paid, yeah. And you send that back to whoever sent it you, and it's been paid for, because yeah. that cheque can't be transferred, because you said you don't deal with it. Yeah. There you go, that's it, and that's that paid for. And where are you guys from there? Where are you from? Where are you from? I, thought, I live in Wilsley. Yeah, but why you, you got a card there? What's that card? ID card. For which company? ID. Don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, we've gone into the bank and the bank has said exactly the same. The bank's just done exactly the same. So you can't cash it where the two places you can cash it. The bank yeah. or the post office. It's been just confirmed. Can't do it. Just confirmed exactly what we're doing. So you're just looking, trying to cash that check. Do you stay 